it's been really interesting to see over the years. Um, so again, I've been out of school for a very long time to see how many of my friends at a time who I assumed were straight and cis have come out over the years as being gay and bi and trans and all kinds of other things. Um, and I think it's also part of it, you know, and it's something that I experienced with a lot of, um, it's a very bittersweet experience for me. Um, on the one hand, I'm excited that more and more of them are coming out over the years. And obviously kids in college now, they're, you know, the, the proportion of them who are coming out is way higher right, than it was 20 years ago when I was in school. So that's obviously very encouraging and very exciting. But then looking back in my experience, you know, when we were, it was a handful of us, you know, in, in many ways and in many circles. And that was quite isolating. And if I went to college today, it would probably be a month. And I love my college experience, but it would have been a much better experience even, right? Yeah. And uh, I don't know if that happens to you guys as well. It's great that people are coming up. I'm like, why are you coming up now and not 20 years ago when we were all in college together? You know, we could have had a bigger uh, circle of friends, right? And things to do and, 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 and things to push for and to fight for and, and to have fun with. So that's, that's kind of what I've been reflecting about. And I think the, the, the reason for that is because everybody has their own timing. I think there's two issues, right? There's a political timing that, that, you know, things get better and more open as time goes by, inevitably, obviously yeah. in some places more than others. And then it's our own personal timeline that sometimes we're not ready and we do need to wait a few months or a few years or sometimes decades. And it sometimes it's, you know, the right timing is the timing that's right for you.